Carcassonne is a tile-placing game set in the famous French city. With a playtime of around 30 minutes, this award-winning 2-5 player game is a modern classic. Players compete by placing tiles in a collective kingdom. Each turn, you simply draw a tile and you place it. Lining up roads, expanding cities, surrounding monasteries with grass, or sending your followers out to claim land will score you points. Once all the tiles have run out, the game ends and the player with the most points wins. Carcassonne is easy to learn, quick to play, and most importantly, it's filled with strategic fun, making it a great family game. Trade, build, and settle in Catan. This top-selling, award-winning board game sees three to four players settle on the uninhabited island of Catan, competing to earn points to win. To play, each of you takes turns to roll dice. These determine which part of the island produces resources. Anyone with a settlement or city on that terrain receives resource cards. Collecting and trading resource cards helps you score points as you build more settlements and cities. The first to reach 10 points wins. Catan combines strategy and negotiation, meaning it's great if you're new to board games. It's sociable, easy to learn, and has a changeable board for a unique experience every time you play. From the island hoppers of the 1930s to the glamorous jetliners of the 60s, Pan Am pioneered global air travel. Adventure to alluring destinations. Claim routes to expand your fortune. And triumph in the golden age of air travel in Pan Am the Game. The classic award-winning board game, Pandemic, challenges two to four players to cooperate and win by curing four deadly diseases. On each turn, you work together to contain the disease. You could move to a new city, treat a disease, share knowledge, or even discover a cure. But curing diseases isn't easy. You can all lose the game if there are too many outbreaks. A disease spreads too much, or you run out of time. Pandemic is a popular, easy to learn cooperative game that puts the fate of the world in your hands. Can you save humanity? Labyrinth, the magical maze game. Move your playing piece through the paths of the maze. Then collect your card and race to the treasure. But watch out. Use the tile to block your opponent's path. Who will be the first to win? Foiled again. The mysterious labyrinth from Ravensburger. Introducing... Sequence. It's a sequence. Five in a row is a sequence. But watch out, because other players can block you. When you get five chips in a row, you win. 
Sequence, it's strategy and fun for everyone. If you've ever heard a word that caused you to burst into song, then Spontaneous, the song game, is for you. Sit down and connect with your family and friends the old-fashioned way. Sing it or shout it. Talent is not required. Spontaneous. Order today. This two to six player game was named the best mind game by Mensa. Spy Alley will have you bluffing, deceiving, and double crossing your friends and family to earn the title of the world's top spy. The object of the game is simple. Each player is a spy for their respective country, and you have to use deductive reasoning to uncover your opponent's identity. At the beginning of the game, each player gets a spy identification card. Let's say in my case, I am a French spy. I then have to move around the board and collect my password, disguise, code book and key and be the first person to return to my embassy to win the game. The catch is to do this without any other players suspecting that I am, in this case, a French spy. The way I do this is to use my money to purchase the material for other spies. For example, if I purchase the password for, say, an American spy, or let's say a disguise for the German spy, then no one will suspect that I am indeed the French spy. At any point in the game, anyone can call out another player's identity. However, if they're wrong, they're out of the game. But if they're right, the other player's out of the game and they get to collect their cash and all their material. And furthermore, they get to choose whether they want to take on that person's identity or not, further throwing people off of their tracks. In Spy Alley, there are plenty of twists and turns to keep the suspense high and your neurons hopping from start to finish.